these were the groups I joined. This is a memorable thing. It was the group, Louis Banks Brotherhood. The Blue Fox Band, I can't believe it. There, isn't that me? That's me, there's Donald, there's Colleen, I think, yeah. And then Bosco, Iggy, Carlton, Peter Saldana, and Johnny Edmonds. A great band of that time. Each one is a hardcore jazz musician, really. Uh, this was the beginning of my career, and and we used to pack the club almost every night. This is Pancre. Things may always stay the way they She had a very big name. Pam Crane means everybody knew. Like Carl, Carlton Keto. I ask anyone who's Carlton Keto, they'll tell you, yeah, we know, we know. She was an amazing singer. She could do anything with any song. She was a great, great singer. Uh, she left Ella behind and then got on to Sarah Vaughan and then Carmen McRae. And then, that was mainstream, you know, staying with the tune and not going outside, not doing too many things outside the harmonies until she heard a record by Betty Carter. And she wanted to sing like Betty Carter. Somebody whispered Louis Banks. Where is he from? Nepal. So Baz and I looked at each other. Nepal. Nepal, I imagine. I imagine a jazz musician coming from Nepal. We did say that, and we can't deny it. We said it like that. And so Baz at that time was saying, yeah, but we, <laughs> we must go in here, you know? So he said, okay, after tonight, go to a Grand Princess and we go and listen to Bluey Bags. And we were sitting at the bar, and then he comes on, and we were absolutely shocked. We went up to Louis, and we, we said, hi, this is Brad, this is Bam. Louis said, wow, you know you guys are here, and I said, yeah. And we want to tell you that, really, you, you are great. Let the music be there too. 